Hi Graham, Phil Beaver here from the Wilderness Club. Just want to recap on our lesson this morning. So here's your swing at the beginning of the lesson on the left. I think the positions are fantastic. Takeaway is very good. Goes slightly inside, but club's in a good position. You know, good hinge there. I like that. It's at the ball. Backswing's always been slightly short, but it's on line. You know, the left arm's good. The right elbow's nice. The shaft angle's pure. The club face is good. As you start down, you have a little shallow, which is good. The club is starting to not drop inside as much. It used to get sort of around here on the way down. And we can see the club head is pulling in front much, much better uh, than last time I saw you, which is good. Coming into impact, it's purely on, it's lovely on line, slightly from the inside, which is great. You know, just tended sometimes just to leave the face a little bit open with the irons. Um, but otherwise a very good swing for impact there. You can see there's still a little bit of loft on the club, but nice. Uh, yeah, it's a good looking swing. The only thing I would say is you could rotate or hit it harder, but I know you've been trying to hit it softer. If you hit it harder, it'd get the lower half out of the way. But, you know, there's nothing really you would pick up on that. Face on was a very good, uh, same similar sort of story. But, you know, we could sort of tell there was something wrong. And, and, and this, this picture shows a lot of it. So we can see here at setup, you've got 60% of your weight on your right side. OK, uh, and this is the good swing. OK, so obviously I'd like a little bit more weight at start to be on your left side, but it's OK. But, you know, when we videoed it before, this is the good one, by the way. We wasn't really getting our weight to our right side. And what I gave you the feeling of doing was trying to feel that your left foot was light at the top of your swing. And we can see now that when you get to the top, we've got nearly 96% of your pressure on your right side. And the beauty is, is this little white ball and this yellow line is almost running linear. You know, we want it running up and down this horizontal line as straight as we can. And it's really, really good. Again, at the top of the swing here, we can see there's 95 pressure on the right side, 92 there. Weight's more in the right heel than the toe, which is great. And now we start pushing off that right side, which is going to give us tremendous power. Now, before the swing before, we only had 45% of weight on our left side. And we can see now we're down to 79% at impact, which is so much better. And I know I kept using probably a bad analogy, but think of the boxer. When he's jabbing, he's on that left side and just throwing jabs to keep the uh, opponent away. But when he wants to floor him, he loads up on that right leg of his and to push off um, to get onto his front foot to give that you know devastating blow. So we can see here, and you're not really, you know, you're not, you're, for you, you've, you've started to feel like you're moving a lot, and this is your first swing of it, but we can see you're not moving much, very good there, and then obviously because it feels weird that everything's moving forwards more, your head thing just chases down the line, which will get better, you know, I would like your head to stay a little bit more passive, but you know, the work, the ball's been hit, the work's all done, even here's tremendous, and then it will just release uh, into a nicer position. But otherwise, it's great, Graham. You've just got to start to feel light left foot, heavy left foot at the right time. Bigger load up. With the driver, let's start trying to give it a whack. Let's try and get a bit more out of it. Lose a little bit of control to gain control, I feel. You know, we could just um, start stepping on the drive, especially down at the coast. It's no rough at the moment. Just give it a whack and enjoy it. Um, and I think we'll get some uh, interesting results. And then have a chat with Jeremy tonight about shafts and things. And uh, I think that might open up your eyes to a, a different story as well. So I hope that will make sense. The positions here are great. Good load up onto the right side. Push in there. Don't forget, it's not lateral. It's pressure into the floor. And, uh, yeah, I look forward to hearing that uh, we're getting a bit more out of the ball. Thank you.